Hey guys, so here is this fourplex deal down in Auburn. So the story with this is I actually had it under contract and then it uh, was contingent on the sale of a townhouse in Seattle, which fell apart. So uh, that's how I have this. I think it's a decent deal at 675, which is their asking price. Two bedroom, one bath each. It's actually two townhouse units and then one unit upstairs and one unit downstairs. And I have pictures. Um, here's the current rent. So you can see that two of the units have been updated. Two of the units need to be updated. Uh, I've got market rent at $1,400 a unit. In my rent rec roll thing here, the rental meter thing, you can see that I'm being relatively conservative, assuming we're going to fully renovate these units. Um, I have them at $15,000 each. So that's like kitchens, floors, paint, appliances. Um, so it could be really cute places, 25% down, 4.4 on the debt service. We'll have to double check that. Um, taxes are from 2019. All the utilities are in here. There's not a lot of income potential really. Cause I'm thinking at 1400, that's going to include utilities. Maybe you could get like, uh, you know, $50 per unit, something like that. Um, but just to be conservative, we'll leave that off. That would be like a bonus if we could get that. I have 100 bucks for pets, $50 per pet. Um, assuming two of the units have them, management, etc. Maintenance is going to be pretty low after you do the renovation. Um, and then this is your return on it. So looking about 1200 bucks a month after we go through and renovate two of the four units. Here are the pictures of the, oops, I didn't want to show the address. <laughs> um, here are the pictures of the place. So you'll see there's carport um, for each unit. There's carport and they can park like tandem. So you go one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And then looks like there's a little more parking over here as well. Um, this is a unit that's not been renovated. This is one of the townhouse style ones. So you can see, I mean, you wouldn't necessarily have to do it because they're fine. They're not like falling apart. They're just outdated. Um, and even some of these appliances look pretty decent. So you'd probably get away without replacing them. That oven looks a little old, but I can't really tell. Um, but yeah, so another thing that's actually a little concerning is there's no railing right here. So <laughs> little things like that might want to fix. Um, but even this looks okay. Like that bathroom has been done it's not like anything spectacular but like that's from home depot you can tell the floor is new this toilet looks okay so um bad bedroom yeah but in general like you can tell it's been pretty well maintained over the years i like the lot a lot <laughs> that's a joke but i do like lots level if you did have a dog you could run around here or a kid um yeah super clean so yeah, there's a street view. So one, two, three, and they all have a storage unit here. And there is a common space, I think it's right here, it, where you could do, um, where you would do, uh, there's a, you could put a washer dryer in there, but all the units have a hookup as well. So either way on that one. All right, that's that deal. Let me know what you think.